The ultimate reason that I love food and I love cooking is purely just because it brings people together and it's something that everyone can enjoy together. It takes a creative mind, but it also takes, in, my, in this line of work, being a personal chef, it takes a lot of um, organization and motivation to get those clients and get out there and let people know that this is a service that's available. I think a lot of people aren't aware that they can actually afford a personal chef. It's not an untouchable, unreachable thing. A lot of people have a story, you know, about cooking with grandma, you know, meat sauce and meatballs on Sunday. I don't really have that. I think one of the reasons I got into it was because I didn't have that. And that's what really fuels my desire to get families around the table. So that's one thing that really helps me get inspired to do the weekly meal prep. One of my favorite things about cooking is that I utilize all my senses. I mean, I'm not only using my eyes, I'm using my palate, I'm using my ears. I can hear if something's searing. I can hear if the water is boiling behind me. I'm using my touch, my feel. I can feel if a steak is done. My smell, you know, I can smell a nutty aroma off a roux, know if it's ready for the sauce yet or not. And um, I just really enjoy that. My favorite is the event side of things because I can be more creative. I just get to create new menus every time I do an event. You know, I really wrap my head around what each person is looking for and custom create the menu based on what they're looking for and what I think will work for them. Whereas the weekly meals are more, you know, family comfort, one, you know, to get the family around the table. Um, that's exciting too, it's just not as fine dining as the events. Someone ever tells me that they don't enjoy food, I think that something's seriously wrong with them. <laughs> you know, Julia Child once said, the people that like to eat are the best kind of people. And I think that's true, but I think that should be everyone. <laughs> I don't think, I think it's very strange when someone doesn't enjoy food. And I think it's very rare. I rarely meet someone that, you know, doesn't enjoy eating. Not all enjoy cooking, that's what I'm good for.